Hey everybody, it's LS11, and welcome back to Fire Emblem Awakening. Last time, we took on a paralogue in which we recruited Yenfei to the team. This time, we've got some stuff in the barracks as well, as a couple supports to take care of. Actually, we've got a lot going on in the barracks today. That's an interesting pair right there. Penae and Libra. Morgan and Sully. <laughs> oh, hey, these two. This is exact. I've actually been working on trying to improve their relationship. Sweet. And Cynthia. Alright, and so with that, let's get on with our two supports we have. Start with Lucina and Batman. <sighs> you there. Something wrong, Lucina. <laughs> oh, hello, Jerome. What? What's the matter? No, wait. I've lost my pendant. What? Oh? What matter of pendant? <sighs> it's called the likeness of my mother. It's very precious to me. Where was the last place you saw it? Uh, no. I took it off when I was cleaning the supply tent, but I didn't want to get scratched. You there. I suppose you've already searched there? <sighs> Many times. Then we should retrace your steps and see what we can't find. Huh? You'll help me a lot? Yes. It's important to you, isn't it? You have my gratitude. You're very... yes, very much so. I simply thank you, Jerome. <laughs> thank me when we find it. Excuse me? Sounds like our last procurement room was another rousing success. Indeed. I'm nearly painless, now that I've grown accustomed to your quirks. These days I feel like I'm starting to understand your taste. Hmm. I don't know, Lorraine. I'm a tough woman, but I figure out sometimes. <laughs> Believe me, there's much of you that remains a mystery to me. But one thing is clear. I ought never think to go shopping alone again. Your help is invaluable. I do hope you'll continue to join me in the future. Right. Hmm. Something the matter, Severa? <clears throat> you say you've started to understand my taste, right? But can you guess what I want right now? Say. I don't understand. Is this a riddle of some kind? Ask me what is in your pocket next. You should be able to read me pretty well by now, right? So I guess what I'm thinking. Telepathy has been scientifically proven to be nothing more than that. Work of try very well. Respect is the same thing I'm thinking. What might that be? Simply I was hoping you would be my partner, not just in shopping, but in all things in life. If that were in fact what you were thinking, I should count myself a very happy man. Granted, that's less mind reading than mere wishful thinking. No, you're right on the money. Truly? Right. Yeah, truly. Oh, well, that's a relief. I'm skeptical of what could happen. Of what would happen if I said all that. I wanted to be rough, rebuffed. <sighs> Someone who's always needing people, you can be so timid when it counts. Well, you'll never lack for brashness with me at your side. <laughs> no doubts on that count. A perfectly mismatched couple we make, huh? Oh, sweet. I like that one. Let me save real quick so I have to sit through all that again. I'm Paralog 22. The Wellspring of Truth. What? Wellspring of Truth. What is that? Some kind of, sort of, local superstition? Mm. Was the legend before? Apparently, the nearby ruin has an unusual spring. Many believe its waters reflect one's true self, whatever that means. Really? Whatever, indeed. I don't need some glorified public to tell me who I am. Hmm. My true self. Huh? Aversa! <sighs> are you the real? Or are you the illusion? Huh? What? If you would learn the answer, give give a chance. What in the Hey. Something wrong? Um There, just now, I I may have seen a Bursa. Hmm? You may have? Hmm. She seemed odd somehow. She said I should give chase to learn the truth. Really? If she's alive, she could be spreading more of her venom across the land. Perhaps it's best that we made certain. <laughs> Let me deselect everyone here. Let me view 
many enemies we're dealing with here. She's an ally for once. There's only 16 enemies. That's not bad. Oh, I bet I know. They're gonna be... They're gonna be reflections of our characters, aren't they? I want to take some of the characters I'm trying to pair, but I also don't want them to go down immediately. Because I know they will. I'm not an idiot. Two more. You know what? Just to try. Just going through making sure nobody has a freaking branch equipped because I dealt with that right now. Spring reflects the truth. If the doubt hounds you, have a look and drown the, that dog forever. You may just find new life and death. Be the way around, perhaps. Hmm? Enough of your riddles. Who are you? I want the truth, and I want it now. <sighs> what? What? Another me? Knew it. I'm a reflection of your true self. Face me, and in one of our deaths, may the truth prevail. <sighs> Killing this guy stops this madness, then I'm all for it. Still, I don't relish the idea of fighting someone who knows my every move. I'm just moving everyone forward at the moment. Trying to be very forward thinking. Eh, waka waka. Something like that. Well, damn. That didn't take long, did it? That took a whopping two seconds of the fight for me to die. The reason I restarted is because, well, I feel like people know that if you die, it's game over, man. Try it this time. Whoa, 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 whoa. How? No, wait. Krom has more than 48 health. She did 24 damage twice. Oh, she probably got Aether or something. Damn it. This time we're going to stay outside of the attack lines. But 
them come to us. Now I can do this. What is that Krom? Why is he using a spear? Forty-nine percent is better than nothing. Thanks, Morgan. Well, there goes me. job, my dude. Just want to see. Okay, they literally don't change the colors of them, they just, just the sprite colors. Interesting. This is so hard. Send the turn. There goes Frederick. Oh god, they've got their own Morgan. I just realized that. Oh my god, that means she got a crit on Walhart. No! Oh wow, we actually didn't get hit. Yep, 
at her. Thank you, Morgan. Yeah, let's have an answer. Just who am I? Barca, do not get yourself killed here, please. There we go. This is such a weird chapter of the game. Such a weird chapter. Be gone, thought. <laughs> I'm sorry, it was Tharja. <laughs> she said be gone, and it was Tharja. I had no choice. I'm sorry. They had to. The opportunity was there. Bye, Virion. That Virion was wearing red. What time he was wearing red? Job, Sully. I desperately want to send Prom in to try and attack, but my luck, he's going to get knocked the heck out. I'm just having Krom stay back for now. Alright, Morgan's done at this point. Oh, yes, oh, yes. yes, you miss. Damn it. Alright, Sully's done. So far, Frederick's the only one we've lost, I believe. Been missing one. I might be forgetting someone, but I think Frederick's the only one. No, we've lost two. I'm trying to think of who we've lost. It'll come back to me. And I'll be like, oh yeah! My Flarge is about to be one of them. Oh! Was it Walhart? Yeah, Lucina freaking crit Walhart. Even though she was only going to do it like half his health, she took him out completely. Get out of here. I'd take out our hardest hitter with like 
our farthest ranged attacker. Mazilia's just run through everyone. Not risking it. They got Frederick. Thank you, Aversa. Very helpful. Oh, well. Maybe we're about to see how Lucina took him down. see. I saw myself, a girl enslaved mind, body and soul by Valador. What? Enslaved? Truth is a bitter satisfaction. You would sooner have died than know that. I should have never come here. Listen. What did you see? Master Valador. I thought I was so clever at the time. In truth, I was so poor. In truth, I was nothing but a fool. God, I stole my memory and filled my mind with a false past. Saving my life, kicking me in. All lies. My entire history invented just so that he could use me as a puppet. What? God, you're horrible. <sighs> I was a girl like any other before he met me. Well, a bit gifted, perhaps, but otherwise I led a normal life. Fate alone led Valador to my village, where he first learned of my power. A cruel design saw him kill all who knew me, and strip away my past. Then he had the audacity to play the role of savior. No. I was reprobated. Out of her edge. <laughs> After that, I became the woman you all know and love. Say what you will about Malador. The man knew talent when he saw it. But in the end, I was just another pawn in his game. A pawn working in the service of my parents' murderer. Gods, I could not be more of a fool. What will you do now? Well... Malador is dead. The one he served still lives. I bury Grima deep, perhaps it's my past with him. Puppet or no, I have wrought terrible atrocities. Slaying Grima will not unmorph that evil, but perhaps it may spare others my fate. Good. If you fight, fight with us. We'll stand a better chance together than going in alone. I've seen you fight, Aversa. You'd make a most welcoming line. <laughs> Even after all we've been through, you'd still have me by your side. Very well, then. They say politics make strange bedfellows. Surely this war trumps all, huh? Nah? Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, with that, we have a Versa on our team now. So there's only one Paralog left, a bunch of DLC missions. And still just some other stuff to show off. Let's check out, oh, we got the final Split Between Man line. Let's do that real quick. I draw your forces out to this line. Death strike with an ambush team from the woods. I see. But I would move here, and now you find yourself in a tra trap in a pincer movement. Crud. Again. <laughs> At least it was just pieces on a board in real life. That would have cost lives. Tacticians are close for their army's survival. A single mistake can be fatal. Don't remind me. But you cannot allow the pressure of that responsibility to st stun you. Running scenarios like this will help prepare for anything. All right. Thanks, Father. I'll give some of your shredded text another day for it. But who? But know this: one of these days, I will outmaneuver you. Yeah. Okay. We'll see about that, kiddo. You're you're always welcome to try me anytime. Always happy to accept the challenge. All right. We're done for today. <laughs> okay. See you tomorrow. How's close? I was up one step shy of getting Holter wiped out. I hope. I hope that to be an attainable goal for a little longer so she can push herself. In actuality, I'm the one who needs to push. Best off for you to push myself. <laughs> that was the shortest high support conversation ever. We have like super high level support from almost everyone that we can, he says as he scrolls through. Anyway, there's only one paralog left, so we'll do that next time on Fire Emblem Awakening. Thank you all for watching this episode of Fire Emblem Awakening. If you like the video, leave me a like. Tell me in the comments down below what you've been series so far. It's almost over. Of course, don't forget to subscribe. It's free, it's easy, and it's out. And I'll see you all tomorrow for more fire. Time to wrap.